My name is Joey Felici. I'm a senior business administration major and management major with a minor in communications. I'm from Omaha, Nebraska. So I started playing football when I was about in the fourth or fifth grade, around eight or nine years old. Um, for the KWAA um, league in Omaha, going into my eighth grade year, I got the opportunity to play more like uh, select football in the uh, Heartland League for the Omaha Thunder. And this was basically just a team that uh, played a bunch of different teams in the Omaha metro area. So you played more teams maybe in um, the Elkhorn, North Omaha, South Omaha. So that was a really good opportunity to just play against a lot of different talent in the um, city of Omaha. My freshman year, because we had to play football before it came basketball season, I had an awesome freshman year of football. And, um, my sophomore year, I was able to just uh, play varsity and JV uh, football and got to play special teams. And then my junior year, I got to play just strictly varsity and um, got to start my first game at uh, corner as well as receiver. So that was really awesome. Senior year was a very successful year for me. Um, I was able to have a lot of tackles um, being in the secondary um, as well as having some touchdowns and being uh, one of the leading receivers on our team. So I, that ended up uh, giving me uh, some accolades towards the end of the season as uh, I was uh, All-State in the Omaha World Herald as well as Super State and Lincoln Journal Star. And really when it all changed was uh, that summer going into my senior year, I was able to get recruited by some schools lightly, not that many uh, Division One schools. I think the only two Division One schools that really kind of had any attention were um, Kansas State and Nebraska. Uh, Nebraska said that they'd let me walk on, so that was an option. I ended up taking a visit up to South Dakota State during the school year when they played North Dakota State, and that was a pretty fun time, but it was way too cold and I didn't like it as much. So then I, I knew I could maybe go up to South Dakota State, but it was going to be kind of far from home. And um, with my dad going to Nebraska, he didn't play too, he kind of let me pick what I wanted to do. He walked on here as well and kind of said, um, if that's what you want to do, go ahead and do it. So my dad walked on here um, in the 80s, ended up earning a scholarship his junior year. Um, he was, I think, all Big 8 uh, his junior and senior year. So um, he so he he loved it. Um, he had some great times. Met met some really good people here. Um, he wouldn't trade it for the world. He said, with the experience that he's had. So I feel like the walk on program here at Nebraska allows um, a lot of in state kids as well as some out of state kids to just an opportunity. Um, is you could say it like that. Whatever you do with that opportunity is up to you. Um, my walk on class that came in here was 16 people, and I think we're down to four or five. So, I mean, we all were presented with an opportunity. It's just those who want to actually um, stick with it, um, fight through some adversity. It's not going to be the best at times. It's not going to be It's not going to be all is what they hype it up to be. Um, but, I mean, is, if, if you stay committed and you, you know what you're working for and then you just believe, um, it'll end up working out, working itself out.